everybody, Robert Dyer, and welcome, welcome to the Robert Dyer Channel Christmas Countdown, where today I was at the grocery store, and holy smokers, there's a brand new Chef Boyardee product. This is called Kickin' Sloppy Joe, and it says pasta in a sweet and spicy tomato and meat sauce. Now this is actually a fairly healthy meal to have because there's only 3% fat for the day. The history of Chef Boyardee is very interesting because he was the chef at the Plaza Hotel in New York, which I find fascinating because I've actually eaten at the Plaza Hotel. And then he went to Cleveland to open his own restaurant. Then people said, how can we have your food at home? Can you give us the recipe? So he started packaging food. Eventually, the army asked him to package his food for World War II for soldiers overseas. And then finally in the 50s, he became known for his commercials, which you can see on YouTube. So let's heat this up in the microwave. And here's a close-up of the package. There's Chef Boyardee on the top. And here's the finished product out of the microwave. You can see we have elbow macaroni, it looks like. I can see some of the chunks of beef in there. Tomato sauce. It's a great green pepper aroma coming off of this. bit of beef aroma. Let's first, I can actually see a bit of green pepper here. Let's try this tomato sauce first. Okay, and now let's try the actual sloppy gin. As you can see, I've absolutely demolished this bowl of the Chef Boyardee Sloppy Joe. Uh, one of the reasons I tested the sauce first is that this one is an uh, entirely new recipe for the brand because this is a little bit less sweet than the typical Chef Boyardee sauce. It has a tang to it. It's very much what you'd expect from a sloppy joe. The actual chunks of green pepper in there, it adds to the sloppy joe experience, but there's also, along with the meat in here, is a borderline chili element at times, because there's, there's also this very high quality beef. It's ground beef, but when I tried it separately, it tastes like it was ground from a good steak. So overall you have a very hearty snack here. It's not quite the size of a full meal, but certainly for a snack or a meal with some other side items. So I'm going to give this product five stars. Hope you like this video. Share it with your friends. Please subscribe and I'll see you next time on this Christmas countdown. Bye, everybody.